guys. Look. Oh, look. Look at this one. Hey. Oh, this one. Don't fall over, bunnies. Don't fall over. Oh, that one's, that one's cute. I like the beige ones. Oh, my God. Stop it. Look at them. Hello, guys. A pile of cute bunnies. I'll get a video. Hey, girls. Hey, girls. What about you, chickens? Oh, yeah, my got, goodness. Look how many chickens. I got my bunny. I got my princess. <laughs> the princess? A good mama. You're a good mama. Good mama. And this one? That's a brownie. I'm not. Brownie. I'm not. I'm not. Yes. Okay, well, yes. we can say goodbye now. Oh, yeah, but it's too good, Mama. Oh, be careful of that black one right there with that hole. Uh, oh, bye, bye, guys. Bye, oh, Hello. It's a pretty miserable day today, but we are on our penultimate night. Actually, that's not right. Penultimate day, because we're going home tomorrow. And, uh,. We are basically just going to go to some farmer's markets, staying local today, as local as you can get in rural Alberta, to be honest. Still probably about a 25-minute drive to get to where we need to be. We've got our Packamax on. Feel good using these for, like, the first time in literally years. That's all creased. And then, yeah, we're going to take you with us, see what we find. And um, it's the 90th anniversary of some kind of, like, co-op store um which is like i said about 20 minutes away so there's like all sorts of things going on there today so we're going to go there first then we are going to be going to some of the farmers markets and just exploring and then hopefully we'll finish all the beers in the fridge when we get back later so come with us oh by the way this is the trailer that we've been sleeping in for the last four or five nights and it's um slept really well didn't think I'd sleep that well, but I've actually slept better now than I did in the $1,200 a night hotel, which I think it's the air quality and just being out in the middle of nowhere, it does help. No air conditioning, stuff like that. I think it really does make a difference. Anyway, see you in a bit. Do you want me to hold the ball? Wait, wait. Wait, Tim. Oh, he won't wait with me, though. Good boy. Come. That didn't work. It didn't work. We'll do it again if later. You come. Good, clever. Wait. Hey, Pete, go stand next to Tim. Oh, it's fine. If you hold the ball. No, 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 no. Sit. 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 Well, just about clean. I got a little bit of Tim on me. You got some Tim on you? <laughs> oh, dears. Good boy, Tim. Sit. Get. Oh, so oh. Cool. oh, that'll do. It's now the 90th anniversary of that specific co-op. I'm not gonna die. And I've got some community things. Thank you. It's like, it's so cute, isn't it? Do you love it? Yeah, it's like... Let's get involved with some festive fun. Well done. Oh, I'm stuck again. <laughs> I got that. No, it's, it's okay, she's getting it on. Come on, Olivia, you got this. Oh, Pete, I don't know, you put the gloves on first. <laughs> Just run, just run, just run, Liv. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Guess it on the chair after so we know you're ready. That's a huge mistake. <laughs> I can't get dressed like that. <laughs> Yeah, just I just wanted to wear the co-op uniform. You know? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> what would you do in a suspended wall? Yeah. Oh yeah, and take it all back off. And take it all back off. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> get it all back off. You got fucking hands on. Ready? Yeah. Wow, good job. <gasps> oh my god, what's going on, Zan? <laughs> You're getting competitive. That was really good. I'm okay at basketball. It should be whoever still has the balls at the end. Otherwise they ping out, you know, because they ping out of the... So the timeline of events. Try the black cherry, it's really good. But the cream soda intrigued me the other day because it's literally red. It also says cane sugar. Uh oh, what does that mean? It's like proper sugar. Proper, proper. proper. Look, it's from 1969. That's why it's so cool. It's literally a classic 60s soda pop.
anniversary. You gotta try it since 1969. Oh, I don't normally like cherries, but cherry flavored stuff is so good. That does not disappoint. Do you want to try this one as well? Because I've got cane sugar in, so you know that's the good stuff. <laughs> no, you'll go hyper. No, no uh, fake sweeteners here. in this since the 60s, right? Absolutely not. They look brand new. <laughs> so I don't get how that's cream soda. I said this the other day. It's literally it tastes like cream soda, but it's got something probably really nasty and cancerous inside. No way. Just sugar. We're just not used to tasting it in drinks anymore. No, but it's, it's got amaranth colouring in it. Amaranth? Amaranth. Okay then. I'm a ramp colour. Oh yeah, you're right. Sticks and stones will break my bones. It's French. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're really good. I don't know, I guess we're going to decide which one we both have now, because I like them both, so cheers. Cheers. Let me try which one we want. I'm going to try and find how I can get a shirt. Oh, wow, Ch okay, cherry's like an intense cherry coke. And cream soda is precisely what it says. I like both of those. Um, I'd be happy with the cream soda with the occasional sip of cherry. Okay, let's do that. We work it. We worked it out. <laughs> Lovely flowers. Cheers. Cheers. those buffs <laughs> buffaloes so I take it that because yeah, there's some of the long hair hanging off of yeah. that one so I take it they lose it when the weather's hotter they lose that thick coat yeah they must melt hi hi buffaloes everyone thinks I'm stupid because nope. <laughs> we're going to the 7 yeah, she's getting. Yeah. She's like, what can I get here what can I Look! Skin crisps. It's crisps. <laughs> what? <The> translation. <laughs> Bean curd skin crisps. <laughs> oh, melty cheese chips. Bean curd skin chips. Bean curd doesn't have skin. Oh, I love Pocky. The translation is not going well. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, there's mango. Uh, there's mango. Coconut cluster puffs. No, we can't eat Oh, Any chocolates we haven't had? Oh, Pete. I mean, oh, Henry. We haven't had it yet. Yeah, we're waiting. Chocolate pudding. They're quite expensive, aren't they? Turkish delight. Crispy crunch. No. They're really good. What are they? They are turtles. Are they actual like chocolate? Yeah. Turtles. Yeah. And they're yeah, we're getting some. Okay. So we need your level of expertise. Flavors. There's different flavours. This one's this salty. Classic. Oh, nuts. No. This one's salty. Or no salty. Yeah. Okay. Then. Any other? Do you have any of these? Oh, yeah, we get them at home. I don't even like them, to be honest. Yeah. See, these, these are all the ones that you can get in England. So dairy milk. After eight, they're always really good. We've got a couple of... Do you have any of these? 
Laffy Taffy. Laffy Taffy is really good. It's expensive, isn't it? And there's a different flavor. There's um, this one's cherry. Well, they're bubble gum. Nope, they're just arrowheads. What's it? What's it? The mystery flavor. Mystery flavor? Yeah. If you get one of these, split in half to you to Pete, and then you split this one in half for you and Pete, and then you split this in half for you and Pete, and then you split this in half for you and Pete. <laughs> All four of them. Which, which one do you want? Watermelon and okay. I think mystery flavor. Okay. Oh my god, there's not. How much is it? I need it. $15. Cheese whiz. I want spreadable cheese. Oh my god. Oops. That's so cool. Don't you think that's cool? Mm -hmm. It's really cool. I might have to get it. Where was this though? Oh, just down there. Love them, they're great noodles, and I've not tried those. Yes, you can get what are these drinks? Peach dragon fruit. I think I had them before. And the big gulp. Okay. Now we're going in the Dollar Ramen. Look! Oh look, you actually blend in. <laughs> you can open the door, right? Stupid. This one? Okay, let's go. But look, it's got the ma bad monkey popcorn, creme brulee caramel flavour. Yeah, they look really good. These are pretty cool. I think it's corn. And then they've got peas, beans, potatoes, and broccoli all the way up there. On the jungle farm. And what are you doing? Dinner strawberries. Yes! We're getting some strawberries. You have to go through the enter sign. Indeed. Oh my God, I love it. So cool. I am the Dairy Queen. I am the Lizard Queen. Beat the heat, grab a blizzard. Oh, cookie batter, cookie dough, cookie, blizzard of the month. We're now going into Dairy Queen, which you'll see behind. And we're gonna get a ice cream cake, an ice cream cake. Cause it's our anniversary today. Cakes. Yeah. Yep. So all of these blizzard cakes? Yeah. And they're all the same flavours? Yeah. Mm, no, actually. Yeah. I don't know if I can water it. There should be someone making it. Okay. Oh, let's go. Okay. Oh my God. The cake. Look at you guys. You look like you're kind of sitting, in a sitting at a birthday party somewhere. Um, Everyone else is dancing and you're just sat by yourself. Happy birthday. I know we might as well just get a spoon and just. I'm gonna have to take a photo of it as well. Yeah, of course. Take the lid off for me. I got basket fry. She did not know what I was saying. I said, can I get the dips now or should I get them when the chips come? And she was like, she just didn't answer <laughs> me. And I was like, I might, like, do people not understand me or something? <laughs> not Why? Have some. Why am I funny? Why am I I feel like. <laughs> no, I still feel. Hello. Say what you got to say. I was going to say, I feel like. Everybody's acquired a new couple of children. This <laughs> so I was like, oh, the basket fries are here. <laughs> yeah. I'm not always like this. Sometimes I'm serious. You're gonna have, you're gonna have a yeah. So we just do, just catch up. Really? Yeah. 
No, I don't really like ketchup. I mean, I could eat it. Whoa. What she's saying is, is when there's ketchup and there's a choice of about 80 other dips, she won't choose ketchup. Right. Okay, that ranch is really good. That buffalo is spice. Yeah. Yeah, it's I really, it's like, lid. it's like Tabasco. Try it, Dad. Okay, thinking of a table saw. Is what they're do using to cut this cake up. <laughs> yeah, just slide it through. Mm. Oh, she's giving her keeping with the metal knife, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's okay. Okay. <laughs> Try the cake. I'm trying that cake. Mm. Mm. It's better than the vanilla ice cream we had at the co-op. Yes. Good. <laughs> yeah, it's really good. So it's cream, like ice cream, right? And then chocolate ice cream, and then that's a cookie in the middle. Mm -hmm. I can't believe we've never heard of ice cream cake. Oh no. I'm just well, deleting him, my fries. Kind of on the way there that you can buy from supermarkets. Vianetta. You know, is it like that? Flavor, but that's got like very thin layers of chocolate in between it, so it's mm. kind of crunchy when you eat it. Okay. It is a bit like Vianetta then. I'll try it. Gotta get a picture. Those rattlers are the grapefruit ones, they're different. Yeah. So these these are like packs. But I don't know what they've got, but they've got like four different ones. Uh that sounds like a, quite a good idea actually. What about that death wave light lager that looks quite good yeah you have to the thing is though you'll be committed to the four whereas if you do that you can you have different ones for like whatever yoga yeah, feels like or whatever i don't mind though if you want to commit to four of a certain type because we know oh work. my god they've got the pina colada baileys <laughs> oh why do they always have the pina colada baileys when i can't get it home look and they've got s'mores that's insane. Yeah, we can't get those. The pe you from the UK. Can't get them at all. Well, no, they do sell. Yeah. We've got like Eaton Mess flavor. The Pina Colada Baileys was like limited edition for like a month, and I didn't get it. And I keep seeing it abroad, but I can't. I can't take that home. Like, no. there's no way, and I can't drink it all. And we're going home tomorrow, <laughs> so I'm like, why did we come here the other day? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well our friends our friends live um literally about twenty minutes away and they said that they were gonna send us over a package so I might send them on a mission right? yeah. to get me some stuff. And your tequila selection is insane as well. We only get like Jose Guerva, that's it. Look at all these beers. They've got seltzers. Oh, I really wanted to try some of those. What's that? Oh, that's vodka. And that's still pretty cool though. I see those bears on, uh, on brews as well, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Darkwood Brewery. Is that, is that Saturday yeah. new beer as well, yeah? yeah they, made a, they made beers somewhere over there, and yeah, the, they came out with the... We just need a little top up, don't we? Like we need sort of four, sorry, eight cans. Maybe. How are, how are they sold? How are they sold? They are sold in fours, right? You can't break them um, up. Some of them are, some of them are six packs, but most of the craft beers are in fours. Okay, that's great. That's um, fine. Like, if you go with the mixed pack, then you get a little bit of each. That's cool. Have in the 12 to 15. 
Okay, because yeah, in some, places, in some places in Europe, you can break those four packs and just buy one. It's really weird. Well, you can't do that in the UK. But we do that like when they break, we do it this way, but that's by accidentalness right. and stuff. Yeah, it's weird in supermarkets in, in like Germany. They, you know what, when you have a, a plastic wrapped, say, six pack bottle of fizzy. Oh, I think we're going to go with that one. <laughs> People will just rip them and take one and then take that and you can. Oh. So you just see ripped packets all over the stores. It's oh, crazy. That is crazy. I and think we can't do that, you know, you either have to buy a single which will cost you more or all the pack, that's all you can do. I think I've picked what I want, I think okay. the Herd, is that a local brewery, the Herd, Calgary? And that's eight cans as well. But they've got okay. a Canadian wheat, they've got a raspberry ale, they've got a hazy IPA yeah. and an Alberta craft yeah, lager, that's a great to, selection. Don't sell it to me, that's it. <laughs> I know, but I just didn't want to get any stouts and we've had loads of the... Um, the Grizzly Port. We've had some. We've and got we've some Albertas some, at we've home. We've had some of the Albertas as well. Yeah, so that would be great to try. These. I can't give you this one, but if you want to take a picture of this, this is all the recipes with these. God, so this brewery, Wild Rose Brewery, do mix your beer. So we've got these two in here. You do half and half, and then you get pink velvet. We're doing that, like that's what we're gonna do. Um, and then the lady at the store showed us all of these other ones. So we just need to check which ones we've got and which ones we can do. But that pink velvet one, I think we should definitely do that with two of the cans. So we've got a raspberry ale, Alberta Craft Lager, and we got Sun Scout, which is a hazy India session ale. That's what we want. And then here we have Velvet Fog Canadian Wheat Ale, which should be a winner. Here's our four. We're getting mashed. Going home tomorrow. Not home yet. Oh, that's another one that I really liked. Yeah. That's a good one. And then, did you get me one of these? Yes, but then I do want to try that as well, so let's do it. Some more B-roll. Some more B-roll. say, this is the A material. <laughs> so, we're making the bullshit pink is velvet. That, me? that was me. Okay. Well, it fizzed up a little bit. Pink velvet. Half velvet fog, half raspberry. 
Oh, I've never done this before in my life. It's so weird, but... Well, it makes sense, doesn't it? Because if they're two beers that gel with each other and they're from the same brewery... I know, and they're saying to do it as well. You know, it's something that they want us to do. Exactly. Move this mango beer. Okay, that one's going to froth up. I thought I could get away with just pouring it regular, but that one's frothier. And then we've still got one each of those flavours to try by themselves. like Because they get wider at the top, this should be a perfect half and half. Because it looks like the first, you know, it looked like the first half, in inverted commas, half. was more, was more, but it's, it's not. Oh, are they cold? There you go. Maybe. I no, hate I'm just, that. I've just got a tiny bit to try of each of those. So. Oh no, you can sip some of mine, but there we go. I'm going to try mine now. Cracking beer, the velvet. It is. Ooh. Oh no, but adding the raspberry to that turns it into like a light fruit wheat beer, like a, a you know, like the Hogarten Rose that we had when mm -hmm. we were in Brussels. It kind of tastes like that. Oh, that's cool. That's great too. Okay. Oh, that'll do. 